How's it going guys? It's the final render here. I have got some fantastic news on the Fallout 76 beta that you guys are definitely going to be happy to know about. Firstly, the beta for Fallout 76 is now available for preload on PC and PlayStation 4. This means you're able to download the beta on PC and PlayStation 4 four days before the beta starts. So now you'll be able to play the beta the moment it starts. Let's go ahead and preload this on the PC. I ordered my copy of the Tricentelli Edition quite a while ago. In fact, I ordered it pretty much the day the game was announced and I'm going to go ahead and preload it now. So since I ordered it online, I've got it on the Bethesda launcher. If you're on PlayStation 4, they do have instructions on their FAQ page, which you can actually find using that link down there to let you know how to download it onto the PlayStation 4. So how big is this? 47.64 gigabytes. That is a whopping load of Fallout right there. Am I allowed to say whopping? That sounds a bit racist in a way. But anyways, that is it downloaded for PC right now. I will be swapping to that version rather than the Xbox version on the 30th of October, which is absolutely fantastic. And some more great news, people. We have all of the beta dates published and ready to go. So now we can plan our timetables around the actual beta. I don't know if this is all of the betas because it ends on November 4th and apparently all the betas are meant to cease at around November 11th. So we'll probably get some more beta dates maybe next week. But firstly, we have tomorrow, October 27th, and that'll be at 5 p.m. Eastern Time to 7 p.m. Eastern Times. And in the UK, that amounts to about 10 p.m. UK time up till midnight. Guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell because we are going to be live streaming this tomorrow. And of course, on the Sunday, which is 12 p.m. to 2 p.m. Eastern Time on October 30th, 7 p.m to 11 p.m. Eastern Time. So that is a four hour block, which is fantastic. There is obviously a bit of a ruckus concerning that these are two hour blocks and people were very upset about it. I was gonna make a video, decided not to. If you can't say anything good, don't say anything at all. So let's ignore the fact that the next two betas are only two hours because the rest of them are longer. And of course, on November 1st, we have 2 p.m. to 7 p.m. And in the UK, that comes out to 6 p.m to 11 p.m. So that is a very nice five hour block, which is really, really cool. And then we've got November 3rd, which is 5 p.m. Eastern time to 9 p.m. Eastern time. That's another four hour block. For me, it is 9 p.m. until 1 a.m. Not as bad as the first day, but not that bad overall. And November 4th, we've got 2 p.m. Eastern time to 9 p.m. Eastern time. And in the UK, that comes out to 7 p.m to 2 a.m. Gosh, I'm going to be losing a lot of sleep, but I was going to be doing that anyway because I'm definitely going to be playing the beta as soon as they go live. So guys, very quick bit of news right here, and I'm sure you guys are very happy about this. Now we have finally got some more beta dates announced along with their times. Not only that, but we can now preload the entire thing on PC and PlayStation 4. Oh god, it's actually going to take 13 and a half hours on my potato internet right now, not rather than my good internet connection. So guys, thank you very much for watching this video. It's been absolutely fantastic to finally get some beta dates in here and make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell in order to see all of the live streams we are going to be doing. I'm going to try to do every single block, but we'll see how it is. I do have capped internet over here. And also make sure you check out all the cool Patreon people in the description below who help support the channel with their financial donations. You yourself, of course, can also do the same. And I'll see you around. This has been the final render, and you've been the audience. Bye-bye for now.